Hey guys, welcome back to I'm Not That Old. Oh. So, um, recently I became a um, monthly donor to um, Stroke Australia or something like that, whatever it is. Oh. I haven't actually read the paperwork yet, but <laughs> $25 a month. I'm like, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, because I went to, uh, I decided to go to a different shop to get my pasta stuff after work. I was like, this is a more convenient shop to go to because it's still on the way home and I don't have to go out of my way. And so, um, there's these, there's these girls or women, uh, trying to get people to donate to the Stroke Foundation, whatever it's called. And, and, she, like, she asked how old I was and I said, I'm 25 and she said, um, well, she, says, she said, oh, what's your secret? And, I'm, and in my head, I'm thinking, I'm, I'm not that old. I'm not that old. I think the secret is... is because that... I know what it is. Like, I've got a baby face. So I, I look younger than I am. Right. And then sometimes people, like, because of my demeanor or something, I come across as being older than I am. Oh, I think what it sounds like, like what she was saying is that you look younger than I look younger, younger than, than I am. Are. Isn't that a compliment? Yeah, it is. But I'm thinking, but 25 isn't that, isn't that old. Oh, I guess. So I'm, I'm sorry. I'm talking about, for me, it's the, what makes me feel my age is the internet. Yeah. I found that as time has gone, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. memes particularly have made, like, I get them less and one, less. One thing, one thing <laughs> that, I feel so that, that, made, that made me feel old was uh, the Isaiah Amato Discord back in the day. Yeah. There was like 14 to 16 year olds on it. Oh, uh, yeah. And I'm like, I feel old. I feel like I have to look was, after and baby Yeah, <laughs> I think that all of the mods were probably the oldest people there by yeah. a long shot. But yeah, online, I, I think I said it in a loadout land, but I was just like, man, yeah. I'm feeling my age. I feel so behind on like internet things. I'm not like crazy behind, but I'm like slowing down, you know? Yeah. <laughs> not to, not just not to disrespect to the, the guys that... That, that came to the Discord and wanted to hang out and talk about all the different things. Yeah. Like, just because they were young doesn't mean... Like, when I started YouTube, I was 14. Yeah. Like, and when I started doing my commentaries, I was 15. Yeah, it's, like, it's fine being young. Yeah. But it's just like, when when you're talking to someone who's 10 years younger than you, and they're like, they're in their teenage years, you feel responsible, like you have to oh, take responsibility. Oh, well, yeah. Because you're an adult. Yeah, well, you're the oldest person. Yeah. Least, and an adult, I guess we are adults and they weren't. Mm. Um, I'll tell you something, what really, ma- what, what it is, I think, that makes me go, that right now that's making me go, I'm feeling old, mm. is that Gen Z, aka Zoomers, <laughs> yep. they are... Um, you need that and that. Or the definition of Gen Z. Yeah. It, it now is sort of their time, right? They are now in their... They've kind of taken over the internet. Oh. A lot of them are like... Some of them are adults. Some of them are like 20 and 21 yeah, and stuff. Yeah, I know. And us, which we're technically millennials, I think. It depends on your definition. Mm. Um, again, I talked about that in Light Out Land. Here you go. Here's your memory back. <laughs> I don't even think I need to do this, but... Here's your bottle of memory, just drink it up. I knew you once, yep. You know me right now, dummy. Mm -hmm. Uh, Anyway, ignoring Ilya for a minute. Um, Mm. Yeah, I just feel like, you know, you got like TikTok and stuff, which I don't understand at all. And I just feel like that we, our generation is just slowly kind of being pushed out, you know? The Mm. younger generation is taken over, especially uh, internet-wise at least. Okay, yeah. And that's I'm feeling that certainly not. In, I'm like, uh, oh wow! I don't. I, when did this happen? I suddenly feel like I'm being uh, my time I is behind me. In terms of running the world, I think our our generation is starting to come into actually taking over. Yes, the, in that sense, yes. Yeah. But in the internet sense, no. Yeah. It's the the zoomers are taking over. Yeah. <laughs> I never ever understand memes. <laughs> well, I was just like look at it. Uh, the the one uh, sometimes I try like a maker kind of meme thing, like um, the video by um, Eric of Internet Common Etiquette. Right. He did like this the one about soy boys. Right. And there was this one bit was like soy boys we're like you except we eat different foods and we bang harder chicks. Yeah, you love that. Man. And I, I love that one so much. And I made like a little picture with the text on it. It's creeps. Uh. <laughs> 
I think I've done that a couple of times. Yeah, I don't really make memes. No. The ones that I find funniest are the ones that are often like outdated by like a couple of What the of heck weeks is with that look he's like? <laughs> he's all like, oh, I can't believe it. He's, he's got a memory back, whatever. Yeah. Who cares, Ilya? You're irrelevant. Get out of this story. Don't give me this shit. This isn't the, the Ilya that I remember from Alden Village who was screaming yeah, she was at a us. Bitch. She was a bitch. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> stole my horse and yelled at me? Yeah. Get out of here. Stop <laughs> moving your mouth without saying anything. I'm expecting to buy a house in the next 12 months. I'm going to get a job in an office. Yeah. I'm, I'm kind of looking at 30 like, you know, things might be pretty good. Yeah, I mean, look, I'm not, I'm not, uh, I am not against growing old. That's, yeah. that's like a big thing. Yeah. Because uh, I know a lot of people who are like, don't remind me that I'm 30 or getting there. I'm not like yeah. that at all. I'm like, it happens to everyone yeah, at the I, same I rate. I used to be, especially like before I got a job, I was like, like, 22 and being like I need to get a job I'm getting old because <laughs> it felt like that everyone else had jobs and was they making a life for themselves and then, but then then I get a job and then I start saving up and then I'm about to buy a house and I'm thinking how many of my friends are actually in that position when they've been doing it longer so you just do your thing yeah, don't compare yourself to other people. I've told you this many times, <laughs> but that's that's my philosophy. Is like yeah. you know, just live your life, do your yeah. thing, do your thing, thing, do your thing, your thing. Um, what I'm saying is that like I'm not scared of getting old. Mm. I'm not afraid to admit how old I am, and I doubt I ever will be. And yeah. I don't feel like oh my youth is behind me. Mm. I don't feel like that at all. I I, I just go like everyone's growing up at the same time. Who yeah. cares? You know. It, it's like, oh, I can't believe it. I'm one year older. Guess what? So is fucking everyone else. Yeah. You know, like, it's 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 chill, dude. Just fucking, just relax. You just shake them. <laughs> um, I just, I guess it's just because I know people who are very sensitive about their age. Yeah. And uh, anyone I would know. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> my, my brother. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, I, I can understand that. Um, he, uh, well, anyway, just pe- people I, I know in general, not just him, but yeah. you know, just, they're like, always saying, oh, don't mind me how old I am, and like, I don't want to get older, and it's like, I, I don't know, man. I just think that it's a pointless thing to fight Well, against. it's like, it's like, yeah, age isn't the actual problem. There's something about your life that you're not happy with. Potentially. There's, well, there's yeah, a lot of people is. see their lives, like you were saying before, in a way that, like, when you're young, you gotta do all of the things. My dad actually has a thing, and it's, it's interesting because it kind of... My dad is the opposite of your, of the generic kind of father figure who's like, you can't be spending your, your, uh, you know, like in shows and stuff, they'll be like, you can't, uh, just be, Jesus Christ, <laughs> these guys are running into me. Hmm. Um, spend your youth uh, drinking and partying and exploring the world. You should be studying and, you know, uh, getting a career and, and stuff like that. My dad's the opposite. <laughs> A guy I go to work with, he's my favourite guy from work. He uh, he says, he, li- he likes to bring it up every now and then in, when we're talking. He says, uh, when I was your age or a little bit younger, I was like in Europe. Just like living a good, on a, he was like on like a year long holiday he, in Europe. Yeah. Well that's the thing, my dad is... But like he'd been working for a long time up until that point. So it was like sort of different to me, I, which is like I've been studying for a I, long time, I time work, to now take the life. Yeah. I work a lot. You might not think about it too. I work on my own projects all the time. It's yeah. my career. And my dad is aware of that. Yeah. And he's like, his main concern is that I'm not getting out enough and exploring the world and seeing things, which is kind of <laughs> funny because it's like the yeah. exact opposite. Yeah. But the thing is, is that I am 100% confident in myself and what I want to do and what yeah. I want to do is well, work as long as you're happy with it and the people who are providing for you when you can't provide for yourself they're like people are happy to have you do that yeah then that's fine exactly there's no reason for it not to be like that nope. oh, shit. It, exactly and you know and that's just that's just life life is about doing what you want to do yeah. and uh, that's it. not letting yourself be uh feel like you have to be doing something right I, yeah. I think that that's a bad way to live because you just spend the whole time feeling that way I yeah. think because there are people in situations uh, like you were describing who might have like a job and a family and everything like that but they're still not content 
Yeah. And it's like, I mean, and I'm not trying to say that everyone's got like this secret passion that they're not fulfilling, but more mm. of just the, like, if that's your goal, then, you know, go for it. But I don't think yeah. everyone's goal should align to be that one generic kind of thing. Yeah. And it's not mine, you know, the kind of person that I am, the kind of things that I'm interested in and do mm. are, um, are not that. You I know, am a, I am a person who likes my two favorite things that are be alone and to work, which for a lot of people is a nightmare yeah. such as yourself. Yeah. <laughs> So, yeah. yeah, I think it's under this rock. The one thing that I'm most looking forward to doing for the rest of my life is being creative and making stuff. Yeah. Hey, Even yeah. though I'll probably be working for all of it, it for, for most of those oh. days, I think that that's going to be. I think just just making just thinking of all the different creative things that I'll be doing is just a fun thing to think about. I was talking because um, I'm. My next racing event, which I told you about, is an off-road sort of a regional sort of event, a bit more regional than the Tail and Bender event that I went to. Mm-hmm. Um, and, uh, this one I'm going with old mate Daz, and uh, what was I? Where was I going with that? I don't even know. I was talking about. Sometimes you just don't know what's going to happen in your life, and that's okay. That's, that's constantly what happens. Like yeah. I was saying just in, the, in an earlier episode, I so didn't I, think that my computer would be broken for five yeah. months, but it was. I didn't think I'd be exactly. getting a puppy as soon as I did, but I did. Yeah. You can never predict this stuff. Oh my sometimes, fucking god! Sometimes things work out very differently to the way you think they're going to. I say more sometimes. Than sometimes. For me, a lot of the time it works out better than I thought it was going to because I set my expectations really low. <laughs> Probably. Although I probably didn't expect I was going to be unemployed for as long as I was, <laughs> yeah. and then I got, and then I and then I started getting jobs, and now it's like everybody wants me. Oh, yeah, I've had several that's, different jobs, but the one I've got now I've had for over a year, and I'm pretty happy with that, as long as I don't die doing it. <laughs> it's, it's you know, if as long as it's making me happy, yeah, if intent yeah. is ideal. Mm-hmm. Anyway, we did talk about existential life stuff. What do you know? Yeah. We were kind of talking about it when we were getting our food earlier. Yeah. And we were like, we won't talk about that. And then we did. Yeah. I don't know if I should talk about it. Have I told you much about Mary the Apocalypse? Like what I've done to it and what I've thought about for it? No. That's well, I, I think um, you've refined Mary to be... I think she was already um, going to be sort of... Have I told you one of the things about Mary... That I've decided. Is it not the drinking thing? She's got a terminal illness. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you did tell me that. Yeah. This kind of part of the story is that uh, Mary has a terminal illness. Mm -hmm. And as a result, she's kind of uh, quite depressed. And uh, doesn't have a very high lease on life. No. Uh, But she meets the apocalypse, who also doesn't respect life in the same way, but is (laughs) way more positive about it. Uh, yeah. in, his, in, in its own way. It's the end of the world. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. So, mm-hmm. Up? No. Oh, I know. Down. Here. Are you still going to do that with the pictures? What, the, having the lyrics in the background? Uh, probably not. <laughs> no. <laughs> but no. it was a fun way to kind of start yeah. it off. And that song kind of inspired the, the new Fucking w- shit! Okay, I, next, I time. I th- next time. Next time, next time.